Welcome everybody, I am Brian Ng. This is Brian Ng doing his thing. I gave Orleans a bad rap last time I came <laughs> over here. I'm here with AC and he oh. is gonna show me Rayan. Orleans, baby. <laughs> There's other stuff. There's dude. a lot of stuff out here. You man. just gotta know people that Well, when actually... did you say that though? Cause like a lot of stuff popped up like over the last That was like two or three couple... weeks ago. Oh, that's it? No, yeah. there's a lot of plots. There, there's a lot of good spots over here. <laughs> I, I find them, you know? I find them, that's what I do. <laughs> here it is. So it's like very cafeteria style here, you know? So you order the stuff over there, they weigh the, the fish or the whatever seafood that you're doing, and they price every It's like a fish market, market. yeah. It's basically like a fish market where you can actually eat here too. Awesome. How uh, do they, they uh, decide how to cook it? Like, because you just said, oh, I'm gonna have some, some scallops or... There's two options. So like sometimes they'll ask you if you either want to barbecue it or fry it over here. Or sometimes they grill it too. It depends on what it is. Okay, okay. Yeah, so those are basically your three options for almost everything. And you can here. mix up everything. So like, I, yeah. want, my, I want my um, my octopus grilled, but I want my shrimp, my shrimp fried and stuff like that. Yeah, exactly. It's, awesome. it's whatever you order, you choose to do whatever you want with it. Like, I don't know if they steam stuff here too, but some things you can't fry, some things you can't. Like, you know, it really depends on the fish that you order. Oh, and the rice was and the salad, is that extra or is it That's, just like... Yeah, it's extra. I think it's like an extra eight or ten bucks or something like that. Right, the salad part of like a, a meal kind of thing that you... Everything's ordered out of the cart here. Oh. Yeah, there's no combo or platters or anything like that. Like, you just order like everything piece by piece. So the rice is interesting because it's more of like a Middle Eastern kind of like Arabic rice. So yeah. there's like some saffron in it. Okay. And uh, it's, it's a little bit different than the rice that we eat as Asian people. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you'll find it. Yeah. And I always love their, their rice because it's always uh, full flavor. Full of rice. Full of flavor yeah. for sure. A lot of saffron. But like, you know what I mean? Some, like we come from cultures where we love white rice. Yeah, right? I know. So where it's like, like there's, 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 no, no, it's, there's flavor in the, in the flavor list. I yeah, find, yeah, right? Yeah. I love white rice. I yeah. can't, I don't know about you. Oh, we grew up with white I rice. I can't go without white rice for longer than like <laughs> yeah. seven days. You know what I mean? Everything yeah. came out really quick as you noticed, right? Like, yeah. It came out pretty quick. Out here. Super quick. Yeah. Um, and they're very busy here. There's also no alcohol here. Uh, it's an Arabic. Uh, <laughs> well, I mean, some people, for them, that's a, that's a deal breaker. Is it though? Like, not for a restaurant. I'm here for food, man. I'm not here to drink. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, family style, you see a lot of whole families coming out here to hang out and, and eat and stuff. Like, yeah. Right. You see all sorts of different cultures coming out here to eat. Well, I think uh, seafood is universal, so. This is like this is it's an amazing type of seafood because like I'm I'm from Toronto like I spent a lot of time going to the seafood restaurants in yeah. Toronto and I never found a place that had that was like fresh like here and like oh yeah and, like family fresh like I mean we eat like Asian style seafood right we yeah. have like the steamed fish and stuff yeah, and, like, yeah, yeah. fried lobsters yeah and stuff like that you know the ginger fried lobster yeah we we eat like the most unhealthiest ways yeah of yeah yeah. Seafood, yeah we seafood. take we take a healthy food and we make it as unhealthy <laughs> as possible that's why vegetables <laughs> taste really good yeah, in that's Asian right. cuisine well, you have to have the vegetables for sure. <laughs> I, I don't imagine me not liking the rice. Yeah. It's, it's a, it's, I just think it's a different comparison from like this rice to any other kind of rice oh, yeah? uh, in the world, I guess. Uh, it's a very interesting take on rice and it has its own flavor for sure. Yeah. Rice is not necessarily my favorite thing here. Okay. But I do like it though. I do, I do enjoy well, I, it. I, do I enjoy hope it. the rice isn't your favorite. It's good. It's it's good. It's yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's a seafood place. Exactly. Exactly. But I wouldn't mind if they actually had uh, an option for just white rice. Or something. Okay. Like, oh, there's a salad. It's like a regular kind of a Greek Mediterranean kind of salad. Okay. Nothing too exotic about the salad, but it's, it's good. You can so tell it's fresh because uh, the lettuce isn't uh, soggy right now. Everything, everything here is fresh. Mm, nice rice. You like rice? I like it. It's got, um, mm. it's pillowy. Mm. You know how um, you, you cook it for a while, steam it for a while, mm -hmm. and you, you get that pillowy um, yeah, yeah, texture yeah. to it. For sure. And it's got that, uh, it's got got a, it. yep, and it's yeah. good, good uh, flavor to it too. Very, very flavorful. Yeah. Yeah. So this is the, the spicier one, eh? Yeah. Oh, it's good. I like this one. Well, I'd like to try that one the next time I come over. Yeah, this is this is definitely good. I prefer this one over the one. I kind of prefer it over the other one. Yeah. yeah. They cook in here perfectly. Don't screw around. Mm. Yep. Now, 
everyone I bring here loves the calamari. All right, that's their favorite thing. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. And they have the two sauces here too: the seafood sauce and the uh, the tartar sauce. Tartar sauce. What do you think about that? Oh, good, right? It's fresh. That's why I love it right now. It's fresh, so it's still, still got that crisp to it. Very light batter. Very tasty batter. Nicely cooked as well. Yeah. So it's not rubbery. Perfect consistency. Yeah. It's not rubbery or anything. It's not wet. It's not soggy. Mm -hmm. all right. And it doesn't have that fishy flavor to it. No, too. not at all. Both sauces are pretty good. Mm -hmm. I like them. This is more like ketchup kind of thing. A little bit. Uh, it's like a cocktail, shrimp cocktail kind of sauce. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's deep fried, so you can eat it. This is really good. This is good. Honestly, Plus, you, you could have a meal just with yeah. the calamari, the shrimp, and the. Tank. All of this would have been. This we is, still have a fish. We have a fish each. Oh, oh fish. I each. want to see the fish. It's a, uh, it's a Egyptian, Egyptian place. I think there's one in, in Montreal. This is Egyptian. Oh, Egyptian wow. owned. Oh, okay. So, there's one in Montreal. I believe they expanded here out in, in Ottawa. Mm. And this is the kind of place. I have to say that you have to like eat it here. Um, you can't take this home because it's just going to soak in the, the yeah, whatever exactly. it is. So the thing is, like during the pandemic, obviously it was very hard for this, for this place because uh, mm -hmm. they only opened this like right before the pandemic started. Basically. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. So I was and they afraid. Kept the float. Yeah, I was afraid that they weren't going to. But I did order one time to bring it home. But, um, it's, it's not the same, but it, it's still not bad. If, if you can get home within ten minutes, it's still yeah. pretty good. If you're in this Orleans area, yeah. it might be worth your trip. Tenth line and it is. Every time my family comes here to visit from from, from Toronto, <laughs> I, I bring them here. Oh yeah. Yeah. That is well, my family spot. This is uh, this is definitely a family spot. Yeah. You can, there's, Every, like tons, you said. there's tons of space too. Everybody loves seafood, man. Yeah. Look at that. How beautiful those grill lines are. This reminds me of what it looked like in Turkey. Although this temple, they didn't put anything on the fish. Oh really? Yeah. It was just like straight up fish. fish. Straight from the water. I feel like the straight from the water kind of taste on the fish. My dad's kind of like that. When I come here to eat it, it feels like this is like where royalty goes to eat, you know what I mean? Like it's just, it does feel like, like that really sometimes. fresh seafood. And it's funny because it's like a cafeteria kind of spot, you know what I mean? <laughs> but the thing is, the food doesn't look like it's cafeteria not, food not, at not, all. Not, not. Just a warning, there is a lot of bones in this fish. Yeah, that's fine. But my dad told me that like the more bones a fish has, the more delicious it is. Mm. And I, I believe him. So it's just a necessary evil. Don't worry, it's scaled and everything because the skin tastes great. <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely. They, oh, they do it properly here, man. Mm. Is that a, was it coriander or what? It, this what is it? parsley. Parsley, that's yeah, it. This is parsley. That parsley flavor actually really gets into the fish. Exactly, yeah. Because I'm not a huge parsley fan usually, but like, as you know, a lot of Arabic cooking, they use yeah. a lot of parsley, like the tabbouleh. Yeah. So, that's it. Yeah, that right. tastes like tabbouleh. Tabbouleh, yeah. Right, so they're very big on their parsley, whereas Asian people are a little bit bigger on the coriander. Yeah. But I don't mind parsley once in a while. I used to hate parsley. It's funny that you just mentioned that because I thought it was coriander because yeah, yeah. I'm so used to having yeah, coriander exactly. on it. <laughs> uh, this is uh, super fresh, perfectly cooked. Yeah, flaky, juicy. Flaky, juicy. Yeah. Uh, even a bit crunchy, even on the, the skin. skin. Yeah, we have great texture. Great texture. This is when you get it grilled. Yeah. I believe you can also fry this, but I think, oh, really? I think you got a, a better option is to have it grilled. This definitely reminds me of Mediterranean uh, mm -hmm. fish. Like even at the side of like next to the ocean basically. Yeah. Right? yeah. Again, watch out for the bones though. Yeah. <laughs> well, I was surprised at how good this place was when I first tried it. This is uh, this is definitely a hidden gem in uh, in Orleans. Yeah. Maybe it's, even it's, Ottawa. Actually. It's popular amongst the, the Arab community out here. Because mm -hmm. um, you see your families coming here all the time. Oh, yeah? Okay. And it's, we're here at 3 o'clock. But once it gets closer to 5, 6 o'clock for dinner time or like lunch time, this place is grand. Mm. 3 o'clock. 3, 3 o'clock, perfect time because it's not so busy. Yeah. That's a pro tip. From pro tip. <laughs> pro tip. And to finish it off, I gotta say, I loved everything. But if I'm gonna come back here to, to order again, I would definitely order the the calamari and the shrimp. So good. The octopus is really good. It's worth a try. Octopus. This is real you love fish. This is like the freshest fish you can probably so get. And top it off with the rice and the, the salad, salad because yeah. it, it really does add to uh, it evens out balance. Well, you gotta have the carbs, man. Yeah, but it also balances out the flavors. Yeah. It's not too too much rich, too rich in, in right. Yeah. Not too greasy or anything. Yeah, well, yeah, you can't be too yet. Hey. Yeah, so yeah. like 
like, um, yeah, so like this, this, this perfect. Okay, well, I would definitely recommend the sea bass, right? Yeah. They have other different fish here. I would like the sea bass because if you don't like the flavor of fish too much, the sea bass is great because it's more of just like a non-fishy kind of flavor. Oh yeah, there's no fla fishy flavor. No fishy flavor on that, so like I think that's good for everyone. Calamari, 100%, is one of some of the best calamari I've ever had in my life this year. Wow. If you want to, if you want to dabble in some of the shrimp, the shrimp is also great. Uh, if, if you're adventurous, some of the octopus, but like the salad and the, and the, and the rice, for sure, a must. Mm -hmm. And they also have other stuff here too. I never tried the, the poutine. They have like a seafood poutine here. Yeah, shrimp. They have like a popcorn shrimp out here. Uh, so I guess those are more for the kid options, I guess, right? Yeah. If you have a kid coming out here, but oh, that's right. You gotta worry about the kids. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they're kid gonna friendly. Eat. Yeah. Uh, yeah. They also have fries, I think they have out here, like some seafood kind of looking fries. But yeah, I, I mean, highly recommend this place. And uh, just if you're a seafood lover, this is a must. This is a must. To me, is the best seafood restaurant in Colorado. Yeah. So if you're in the Orleans area, definitely check it out. If you're from outside of the Orleans area. Time to make a trek all the way over to Orleans. <laughs> oh, it's a must. It's a must. Until next time, everybody. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Until the next video. Bye.